10 years ago, you could see that China was growing quickly. It was a relatively small economy, uh, but you could see if they kept growing, it was on the way to being the biggest, and there was gonna be a rivalry between the United States and China that was strategic, technological, economic, and in other ways. These are the two powerful countries and uh, nations in, in the world right now. They are the two major countries in, in, in the artificial intelligence and technology sector. You know, you look at the 20 most valuable companies, 11 are from the US, nine are from China. A country that goes from nothing to where it is today can copy what's successful. But as you become more competitive with the West, then it means that you have to go off on your own. You have mobile payment systems, you have a collection of financial services with artificial intelligence that Chinese have shown on a very reasonable basis that you have uh, platform-centered, digitally enabled ecosystems which enable new business models. This is a hugely positive development. They're trying to think about how to use modern technology going up the value scale to compete with Germany, Japan, the US. You know, I really uh, respect uh, Chinese people and their ability to um, actually innovate and create and compete in the world.